Hi, I'm Dr. Raymond Douglas, and welcome to an episode of Thyroid Thursday. Today, I'm going to speak a little bit about cures for Graves' disease. We get this question quite a bit. How do you cure Graves' disease? Well, unfortunately, I don't think that there is a cure, but there are really quite a few things that can be done anywhere from a natural process and natural solutions to medications. The first thing to understand is that Graves' disease is an autoimmune condition that starts in the bone marrow and it attacks several organs. The one organ it attacks is the thyroid, but it also attacks both the skin and the tissue around the eyes. And as any autoimmune disease, it has these cells from the immune system that get into the tissue and can destroy it. So instead of attacking a bacteria or virus, it begins, your own immune system begins to attack your own cells. And unfortunately, we don't have a great way of curing this process or stopping it. There are some medications that can impair the immune system, but usually they do probably far more damage than they're worth, at least as far as pursuing. But what we can do is that once this disease has either stopped or and can be controlled is that we start you on thyroid medication to even out the thyroid hormone levels. And while that's not a cure, what that does is it reduces all the symptoms of Graves' disease. And we have another YouTube video demonstrating all the symptoms and problems associated with Graves' disease, but thyroid medicine can help quite a bit. There's also very many natural remedies or natural processes that you can, you can do. You're going to see many more videos about exercise, diet, but these are two incredibly important components when you have Graves' disease. Exercise not only is great for the body and to relieve and to in, reinvigorate and give you energy, but it actually reduces the stress and from the mind and the mind-body, improves the mind-body connection. You'll see some more videos about this and how to specifically exercise in Graves' disease and what natural foods you can use. But it's very important to at least consider those as part of this process. Once the thyroid is under control, sometimes the thyroid has to be removed because it's so large and causing a problem. Or you may have to take thyroid medication some people have to take it for the rest of their lives. Others are able to stop at some point in time. So while there's not a cure, this disease, you can work with it and you can overcome it in the long term. So you don't miss any of our segments talking about thyroid disease or thyroid eye disease. Please subscribe to our YouTube channel so that we can make sure that you're included in the latest information that comes out. We appreciate all your feedback and your attention. Thanks so much.